Hello and welcome back everybody. Today on Linux Scoop, we will show you step-by-step -step how to install WordPress with Nginx on a Debian 10 VPS. As we know, WordPress is one of the most popular content management systems known all over the world. It is an open source CMS platform based on PHP and MySQL. WordPress allows you to set up flexible and powerful websites easily. To follow this video tutorial, you will need a Debian 10 VPS with root access or a user with pseudo privileges, a fully registered domain name that is set up and pointing to your VPS IP address. For example, in this video tutorial, we will use the domain linuxscoop.cc. Step 1. Deploy Debian 10 VPS. Thanks to UpCloud for sponsoring this video. UpCloud is an extremely fast cloud hosting service, very affordable, easy to get started with and provides a lot of value in their different solutions. Also, great for any business that is small or large and as someone who's really trying to start doing some website stuff. Get $50 in credit on your new account by signing up with promo code LINUXSCOOP or use the link in the description. To deploy Debian 10 in UpCloud simple and easy, log into your account. Click the server. Click Deploy Server. Choose the server location. Select Plan. In this tutorial, we will be using the plan $10 per month. On the operating system, select Debian 10. Then click Deploy button. Go to the network. On column reverse DNS name change with your domain name. Step 2. Initial Server Setup In this step, we will create a new user account that will add to sudo group and configuring SSH. Now, from your terminal login to Debian 10 Server. After you have logged in, run the following command to make sure that all installed packages on the Debian 10 server are updated to their latest available versions. Create a new user account. We will give the name Debian. Now, run this command to add the new user to the sudo group. Now that we have our new account, we can secure our server a little bit by modifying its SSH daemon configuration to disallow remote SSH access to the root account. Begin by opening the configuration file with Nanotext Editor. Find the following sections, add and change the information where applicable. Add these lines to the bottom of the document. When you are finished making your changes, save and close by hitting Ctrl O X. Restart the SSH service.
log out from the root session. You can type exit or hit the button, Control D. Then log in again using user with pseudo privileges. Keep stay login on this session. We will continue to install Nginx, PHP, and MariaDB. Step 3. Install Nginx, PHP, and MariaDB. WordPress requires a web server on which it will serve its content. It is written in PHP and uses a MySQL, MariaDB database to store its information. We can install Nginx, MariaDB, PHP, and other PHP modules by running the following command. Once all the packages are installed, open the PHP INI file and tweak some settings. Find and make change the following sections. Save and close the file, then restart PHP FPM service to apply the configuration changes. Step 4. Configure Nginx for WordPress. In this step, we will configure Nginx site configuration file for WordPress. This file will control how users access WordPress content. Run these commands to create a new configuration file called linuxscoop.cc. On section Server Name, replace the domain name with your registered domain name. Save and close the file. It's recommended to check Nginx syntax errors by typing this command. Next, you should enable the server block by creating a symbolic link to the site's enabled directory. Finally, restart the Nginx and PHP FPM services to apply the configuration changes. Step 5. Configure a WordPress database. Run the commands that to secure the database server with a root password if you were not prompted to do so during the installation.
Now, log in to MariaDB as root. Create a database called DB Linux Scoop. Create MariaDB new user account. Set a password and grant access to the database we created. Remember to choose a strong password for your database user. Flush the database so changes can reflect in MariaDB. Finally, exit from MariaDB shell. Step 6. Download and install WordPress. In this step, we will need to download the latest version of the WordPress source from its official website. Run these commands to download the latest release of WordPress. Once the download is completed, extract the downloaded file. Copy the sample configuration file. Copy all the WordPress files to VAR WWW Linux Scoop directory. Generate WordPress secret key. Copy and paste the WordPress secret file to wp-config-php. Then enter the database name, database user, database password, and database host that we have created in step 5. Change the ownership all of WordPress files to the www data user and group. Step 7. Install free TLS SSL certificates. In this step, we will be installing the Let's Encrypt SSL certificates. It's useful for configuring web servers to use the SSL certificates. We need to install the CertBot package for Nginx called Python 3 CertBot Nginx package. Now, install dependencies for Python 3 CertBot Nginx package. Install the Python 3 CertBot Nginx package.
Fetch and deploy Let's Encrypt SSL certificate on your domain with these commands. Step 8. Setting up the firewall. In this step, we will install UFW package and create rule to allow SSH, HTTP and HTTPS connection. Install UFW. Enable UFW service. Allows SSH connection on port 22500 using the TCP protocol. Allows HTTP connection on port 80. Allows HTTPS connection on port 443. Check the status of your rules now by typing. Step 9. Access the WordPress site. Now, open your web browser and visit the URL, HTTPS, your domain. You will be directed to the WordPress installation page. Select your language and click on the Continue button. Provide your WordPress site name, admin username, password, email, and finally click on the Install WordPress button. Now click on the Login button. Provide your admin username or email and password and click on the Login button. You should see the WordPress default dashboard in the following screen. That's it! Step-by-step, step, how to install WordPress with Nginx on Debian 10 VPS. Now, WordPress is ready to use. You can now start by installing new themes and plugins as per your needs. To learn more about WordPress, visit the WordPress documentation. If you have any questions, comment below. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.